Good. <laughs> Let's try this again real quick. I just want to see if we can do this. Man, I'm missing him a lot. He's getting evasion, evasion, evasion. Can I target his blade? Evasion, evasion. What the shit's going on here, man? And he's hitting like three times harder than me, too. Yeah, I can't beat this guy right now. This is ridiculous. Guy's decimating me. The hell, man? I'm two levels above him. Huh. Oh well. I guess I got a lot to learn. Can I use my healer? Uh, maybe. I, I, I don't know how to heal with him. Okay, what do I do? Oh, 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 I'm actually switching my blade. Stop it. Ah! Get off my screen. Okay. Yeah, there she is. Okay. So, um... Hmm. When landing a hit restores 30% of damage dealt to the whole party. Oh. Absorbs 60% of critical damage dealt as HP. Spawns an HP potion on hit with a 60% chance to spawn too. Oh. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. I feel like I want to buy more of these. Outside of the city, these ones we have to run to now. Let's do these first. Because they're like right over here. Somewhere. Yeah, one's over here. There's one. Dward. Dward. Like your name. Alright, this guy hasn't heard anything about it. Oh, we got two more quests over here. Nice. Let's grab this quest. This may be for the other one we did earlier. Yo. What's up, dude? Yo. Okay, he needs materials. Pear Torgos Crane. I don't know where we're supposed to get these. Where are the winding gears? Hey, darling! Oh, we should do the main quest first? Okay. Um, that's probably a good idea. We want to get our party set up anyway before we start going out and doing quests and stuff. Hopefully we'll get Nia back. Or someone else. How many days have I played Xenoblade? Uh, I've played Xenoblade. Today is day number two. Um, in terms of how many days I'm going to play it, it's going to be a day-by-day -day thing. Um, I can tell you that I'm going to play it tomorrow. So, I can tell you that much. Wall painting? Whoa! Read ancient writing. Okay. Check the arts menu to see the different blade, uh, attacks your blade has. Okay. Oh, wait a second. So... Oh... Oh, I see.
see. I see, I see. Okay. I think this is the strongest attack we have by far. It does a huge... Excuse me. It does a huge amount of damage and blows them down? That seems good. That seems really good. And it's a circle. Um, that seems really good? I don't know. Maybe not. Mailman says, love the EverQuest shirt. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> Appreciate it, man. Uh, also, thank you, Thisic. Says, Merry Christmas, Co. Congrats on a wonderful year. Thank you, man. Uh, Clockwork Dork with the 252. Thank you. And Jedi B with the three years. Oh, it's my pleasure, man. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Really do appreciate it. Um, Alan Awesome with a thousand cheer. Captain Strong with a thousand holiday cheer. Really appreciate that, guys. Forever Undead. Thank you very much, man. Really appreciate that, too, with that $10 tip. Thank you, guys. A lot of love today. I appreciate that. Greatly. Okay, I think we'll keep main blade and healer for now. But... We'll keep poking around. Oh! Hey, guys, I got a question. I got a question. So, my Nintendo Switch, you know how it clicks into the two things on the side and the other controllers? The two side things on the mobile Nintendo Switch are absolute ass. I hate them. I hate them. Um, can I get things that slide on to the side of the Switch that have like actual little control sticks on them? Not like those little pansy ass cell phone con things. Like, I love this Pro Controller. I love this. I want to cut this Pro Controller in half and stick it on each side of my Switch. In fact, lost opportunity, Nintendo. You should have had this Pro, con pro Controller been able to split and put on the side of the thing. Um, but just saying. So there's no, there's no like, plug-ins that do that? Why not, man? That'd be so cool. That'd be so cool. They should really sell a version of the classic controller that you can slide in half and just click into both sides of that. That would be so badass. I would spend a hundred bucks on that. Um, anyway, okay, let's keep going. Seriously, to have like a decent control stick on each side of that little tiny screen. Because those control sticks on the side of the, the mobile switch, they're bad. They're bad. Um, like it, it, I really don't like them. They're, they're not accurate. They're alien. They feel weird. I don't like them. Sparrow McGee says, don't give them horrible ideas. That's a damn good idea, Sparrow. You can shut up. Just saying. You, you can shut your mouth. Because that's a good idea. Jerk. Yeah, Electric Cooper? Awesome, dude. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, they may feel fine. I'm sure they feel fine to some people. I have really, I have big hands. So for me, they're so tiny. Like, I can't, I, I can't, I have a real hard time being accurate with them. Um, it's really tough for me. It's really tough for me. And I have tried. I tried, when I first got my Switch, I tried playing Zelda uh, offline. And, uh, oh, man, I, I couldn't, I couldn't aim at all. Like, when I would throw bombs and stuff. I had such a hard time aiming. But again, it's probably because I have old man big hands. Oh yeah, we'll get a hand surgery then, Co. Problem solved. Right on, Sparrow. I, that sounds like a good plan. I'll just get a hand surgery and, and put it, I'll get, I'll get those little tiny hands from SNL. You remember that girl on SNL with the big forehead and tiny hands? I'm gonna get those installed, that'd be great. 
<laughs> the Switch has GameCube adapter support. Oh. Oh, well, I mean, yeah, I guess... Okay, so wait a second. Okay, here's a, here's a really dumb question. I can just plug my Pro Controller into the mobile Switch, right? Is that... I mean, I can just do that, right? So I could, like... I could look at the little screen, and I could plug in the Pro, right? Yeah. I hope so. Yeah, I can. Okay, cool. Eh, that'll work, I guess. You can tell I use my Switch all the time, right? <laughs> he says, asking basic questions. Okay, cool. Good. I guess I guess we can just do that, but... Oh, it's wireless? Oh, I didn't realize it was wireless. Mine's been plugged in the whole time. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, anyway. You guys see if there's anything down here. Ah, here we go. Let's use some of our cores. X key is on this thing. Jesus. Okay. Why you gotta be different, Nintendo? How am I liking the game so far? Uh, it's been pretty good. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like over five hours in now and I've been enjoying it. Attack stone. Okay, so this is gonna be like, this is gonna be tough. Cause I don't know where these damn buttons are. I missed that one, got that one. Got that one. Okay, that's good at least. Oh, Tri War. How do you like that? Does that work? I need to put my longest charge up ability as X. Can I do that? What is that? Arts Stealth 1? Wait, I just got an art from him? That's pretty cool. Time for some treasure hunting. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we got it. It's an ox core, right? Okay, let's get this stuff first. Okay, I'm gonna try this healing person for a second here. Oh wait, I can't bring her in yet. She's got a like a power up or something going on. Oh dude, I'm like stuck here. Uh this isn't good. Damn girl! I like how quick this attacks. Cool, man. Opening art one. I don't know what that is. Trick mirror. 
All right, let's do, we'll do two more. Time for some treasure hunting. Something good. Hell yeah. We're waiting for the moons to charge up in the bottom right. Man, we're getting so many ox cores. A fluffy hat. Badass. Awesome. We're not quite making back the money that we spent, but... This game is on which platform? Uh, Kairos the one. This is on Switch. Nintendo Switch. Damn! Whoa! Look at all this stuff. Awesome. And no enemy. I'll take it. Alright. That was fun. We got a bunch of stuff. I have no idea what any of it does. Cool. Activate the main quest. Yeah, I should. Up, oh, hit the wrong button. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, we have to go up. Bumblebee tuna. Bumblebee tuna. I'm the right. <laughs> hey, Grawl. Oh, I know about unique monsters. Yep, we good. We good on uniques. Justice Booster and Compassion Booster. Whatever those are. More Ardain Consulate. You're all mine. More boosters. Am I going in here? Oh, I can't. But it looks like there may be a way down here. Oh. <gasps> We're swimming. How am I going to get up? Can we get up? <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh oh. Oh, wait, I can just teleport here, can't I? How cool. Uh, sure, there. Awesome. That's why I look over in chat and everyone's like, fast travel, fast travel, co, fast travel. <laughs> yeah, I should have. Here we go. Informant. 
Informant by trade cannot provide information without proper compensation. <laughs> um, sure. Okay. Inside the Titan battleship. Buy core chips? Oh, we, we can buy more core chips? Wait, where do we buy core chips? We can buy ox cores. Oh, damn. Oh, core chips, not cores. The weapons. This guy. Yeah, we already did that. We're good. Yeah, we, we got the wing chip, which is all we really want right now, so we're fine. That's fine. Yeah, 500k is uh, a, a girl in a bathtub, from what I understand. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Kawaii. Oh, here we go. Great. Nia and Dromark executed. It doesn't bear thinking about. But getting aboard that warship will be no mean feat. We're going to need an ironclad plan. Army port is under heavy guard. Whoa. I guess we'll just have to mount a full-on attack. No, Rex, we can't put everyone in danger. Right. Sorry. There. This is one of the Grand Arbor's routes, right? If this map is correct, it goes all the way from the key to the hull of the warship. Quay. And here. It looks like some kind of cargo entrance. Could we sneak on that way? Oh, right. No one will spot us if we sneak in from below. Security light around this entrance. At night, not even workers here. Looks like this is our only option. Then it's a plan. <laughs> Tora? Tora have something to show you. What's this, then? Nobody ever see this before. Secret of Torah. An artificial blade. An artificial blade? I can't believe it. Torah have always wanted to be driver of blade. But Torah... Uh, Torah has no potential to awaken Core Crystal. How could you know that? Surely you just have to try and... Oh, you did, didn't you? Oh, so they don't die. Yes, one year ago. Okay. Tora applied to drive a recruitment man. Oh, dearie me. Oh, Tora, you mean you... It was bad. Tora had nosebleed for three days. Just, uh... Noseblade. What you mean, just? People die from loss of blood, you know. Yeah, but from a nosebleed. Anyway, moving on. For a near-death experience, you're awfully casual about this. Anyway, back to Tora's blade. <laughs> when complete, even no potential Tora can be a driver. This is simply incredible. You built this blade from scratch, Tora? It was started by Grampypon and Dadapon. But Grampypon die, and Tora still not know where Dadapon go to. 
Oh. So Tora will finish Blade myself and become a driver like always wanted. Then Dad upon hear about Tora's success and come back home, yes? Oh, Tora. Maybe if I go out and get the pack of cigarettes, then Dad will finally come home from that time he left to get some. By the by, Tora, this blade, as far as I can see, it looks complete. What is there left to do? <laughs> All Tora have left to do is buy missing parts. But Tora have no money at all. Oh, really? Really? Nothing. At all. Not even one gold. Oh. So you're asking for a loan? Uh, not loan. <laughs> um, closer to generous donation. Just like a nopon. <laughs> Always shrewd when it comes to gold. But, but, but if Tora completes Artificial Blade, combat capabilities will be big help on mission. I love how they don't know proper yeah. grammar, but no if words like works, capabilities. Point. So, how much exactly do you need? Oh, no more than 60,000 gold. 60,000? Do you want a kidney as well? Calm down, Rex. I think we owe Tora our help. If it's just money he needs, I may be able to assist. Assist? How exactly? Well, I know this corner. Nothing illegal. I pulled. <laughs> <laughs> this is a natural crystal. It should fetch around 60,000. No way. We can't let you sell Yeah, that. no! But... No, it wouldn't be right. That's it, I'm paying for the parts myself. Very admirable. Mama! Rex Rex is too generous. This blade <laughs> Gramps is Co's spirit animal. <laughs> uh, leave that to Tora. Well then, let's go, I guess. Yippee! Will they really be okay? I suppose they'll have to be. I have to admit, kind of like this channel is sometimes, um, I feel like there's there's more than a few adult jokes, like clearly meant for adult jokes in this game, uh, that just go right over, like, the target audience. Um, I, I, it's, that, that's been kind of fun. That's been kind of fun. As long as they keep that up, as long as they keep that up, that's the kind of thing that can hold my attention. I, I really like, in Disney movies, when you're kind of like in on the joke. I like that, that's good stuff. That makes, that's very entertaining to me. Mm, okay. So wait. All right, all right, I think I know what we're doing here. Come out, come out. Okay, cool. All right, let's head to this waypoint. Yeah, the target audience of this game is is clearly not adults. Well, I say that it's weird because in American culture, we would look at this and say, this is not a game meant for adults. But in Japanese culture, it, it very easily is seen as an adult game. So I can't really say it's not angled towards, towards adults because it is a Japanese game angled towards Japanese culture that we're, and we're just playing it. So it's kind of hard to tell. Um, yeah, I'd say like, I'd say like in Japan, this is a game for like adults, young adults and teens. But in America, it's more like teens and young adults. Um, but I don't know, it, it's, that's an interesting discussion for another time. Let's keep moving. I would say this game is aimed at 20 plus. I, uh, I don't know, man. When you when you see characters that have the ginormous eyes, um, unless it's like a mature rated anime, then it's a lot of times angled like, it's, it's weird. It's weird. 
Yeah, I think it's I think it's also not only weird, but it's also kind of based on for you know, it's very opinion oriented. Oh, we need to change out that skill. Oh damn, this is a level five. The other guys were only like two and three. How do I know what hit of my combo I have? Magnificent. Magnificent. Cunning stunt. Okay, I need to be looking at these things I've been getting. Also, maybe we have some treasure to sell. Uh, okay, first let's do this. I want your art. This one. Um, yeah, I want to put this guy here. Yeah, okay, good. And then what is Rolling Smash as less aggro? Uh, but it has a huge damage ratio. A huge damage ratio. Um, let's let's bring let's bring you in instead of the behind the back one. Because we're not really able to use that too much. Actually, maybe we should put that in the first one. Because that is our highest damage, and this way we can just use it right when the fight starts. Hell yeah! I'm not I'm not upgrading any skills yet. Oh, that's on purpose. Okay. Wow. That's what I'm talking about, dude. Man, that is how you start a fight right there. Beautiful. Wait, what? Each blade has their own upgrade points? Wait, wait, are you serious? So if I go here, and then I switch... No. Oh, yeah, look at that! WP in the top. Oh, shit. Okay, well, let's upgrade this. I want more damage. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Let's do another one. Let's go ahead and exhaust him here. Let me go buy some more. Now that I have the time delay down, there is definitely a delay on input. But now that I know that, it's become a lot easier to do these. Ooh. Hey, by the way, does anyone know that trick that Bikeman was using to get more cores? I know it had something to do with a salvaging spot, but that's like all I know about it. We need to sell these. Oh, it's a lot further in the story. I need to be higher level? Okay, thanks. Uh, don't worry about it then. Don't worry about it then. I should get the silver ones next? Okay. Yeah, this is kind of like fishing. Yeah, sort of. Yeah.
Cool. Damn, a lot. One. Two. Boom! Man, that whole combo set is real. Damn, look at all this stuff. Common core crystal. Oh, shit. Okay. All right, last one. Time for some treasure. What other games do I play on the Switch? Uh, none. <laughs> Just this right now. Pelagius, I know, right? Kawaii. <laughs> Hopefully we got at least one treasure set out of this. I don't know how those treasure sets work, but... Oh, level six. One. Two. Three. Oh, there we go. Oh, wait, was that one again? Oh, God, that didn't hit for much. Where are you going? Oh, you dead already? Man, I got stuff I want to try, but it's, I can't try to keep dying so quick. Jerk. But that's it, right? We That's everything? Yeah, okay, good. Moe! <laughs>